All right, guys, I know if you're like me, whenever you have to call a customer service line, you hate talking to those automated machine people. Luckily, there's all sorts of really cool life hacks online that claim to get you to a human being faster. The first one is hitting zero a bunch, old school operator style. The second one is stating that you're a new customer. And the third one, which I'm pretty excited about, is apparently they have bots that recognize if you're frustrated and if you're cursing. So we're gonna try all three of those, starting with everyone's favorite bank, Bank of America. Try LiveLink for free right now and instantly chat with sexy local singles ready to make a connection. My so it turns out John Michael gave us the uh, phone number for a sex line and not Bank of America. Luckily, one of our poor, poor crew members is a Bank of America customer and gave us their actual phone number. Welcome to Card Services. Please enter your account number. Zero. Zero. I'm feeling it thinks that's my card number. Please enter the account. They hung up on me! Assholes, now I really am pissed. Calling them back. New customer. Operator. I'm sorry, I didn't get your response. Para servicio en español, presione el botón de estrella. For new customer. I'm a new customer! They hung up on me again! Think of America. You're just assholes. Ah, oh, this is such bullshit. God, it's just... I don't have time for this. I've got three kids, and I work a full-time job. I mean, this is just... Oh, this is bullshit. I'm sorry, I didn't get your response. Para servicio en español, presione el botón de estrella. Okay, we have to be really quiet because they're calling customer service in the other room. But... Look at this sink, it is so small. Is a sink like this actually gonna work? So we're gonna test it. B of A was kind of a bust. They, they suck. So instead, we're gonna move on to everyone in Southern California's favorite monopoly. Good evening, welcome to Time Warner Cable. This call may be monitored or recorded. To use our enhanced system that lets you respond using your voice, press pound. Para español, más que cinco. Zero. Please enter the 10 digit phone number associated with your account. Or if you don't have an account, press 1. Zero. <laughs> I'm a rebel. To add service, Zero. press. All right. I'll connect you with a customer service representative. Oh! One moment, please. Please enter your five digit zip code. Zero. Let me transfer you to a customer service representative. One moment, please. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Time Warner Cable is interested in your feedback on how we can provide the best service to you. If you will be willing to answer a few questions regarding the service you are about to receive, we would like to call you back. Two. I don't want to give feedback. Did you also know that in 1904, greased pole climbing and mud fighting were popular? What if I hit zero again? Very frolic inducing music. Did you also? Neptune is 4.4 billion kilometers from Earth. Sorry guys, I don't think this hack really works. I mean it kind of worked, but not I'm still listening to the soundtrack of Juno, so how about we try the uh, Department of Water and Power? Thank you for calling your lesson. In a few short words, please say the purpose of your Say power or water trouble or press one. Oh, damn suckers. Sucker mother San Francisco suckers. Please hold for the next available customer service representative. Your call may be recorded. Department of Water and Power, Ms. McDaniel speaking. How can I help you? Your call may be monitored for safety reasons. Safety reasons? <laughs> it worked! It worked! <laughs> I don't know what to do! I'm so excited! What do I do? <laughs> JM! John Michael! Michelle! What? I'm, they're details! Michelle, did you did you happen to talk to uh, Marisha about uh, her trying to reach a human being on customer service? 
I did a little bit, but I kind of want to know exactly what happened when you started swearing. Well, we started with Bank of America, trying all the zeros, and we were trying, you know, seeing new customer and things like that. So we were like, all right, let's let's just jump to the Department of Water and Power, mm -hmm. which is notoriously, Best. yeah, just the worst oh my God. in California. It automatically goes into like, okay, if you know your party's extension number, put that in. If you, you know, reason why you're calling, state it here. And I was just like, God damn it, this shit pisses me off. And I tried to like sound like an old curmudgeoning old man. And then I started getting all dead with motherfucking <laughs> cock sucking motherfuckers. And it immediately was like quiet for a second. It was almost like the machine was like slightly offended and paused and was like, you are now being transferred to a customer service representative. <laughs> and we were like, shut up, shut up. And it, read, it rang like twice. I was like, okay, well let's see if I get put on hold waiting for this. No, it rang like twice and it immediately picked up and was like, hi, what's your problem? Hi, are you okay? And I was like, ah. <laughs> this, this it worked like we were on the phone for maybe 30 seconds. Okay, so this, this, is, this, is, yeah. this is amazing to me. Water and power during regular working hours with an emergency is hard to get a hold of. I have, yeah. I have tried to get a hold of them. This was a Saturday. This was a Saturday. Their website says they have no customer service on weekends. Like we were kind of sure we would not reach anyone. So that hack is confirmed in certain situations. I mean, that, yeah. that hack is you can cheat life by calling water and power and cursing, which is amazing to me. It kind of makes weird sense because if you're cursing to the power company, that probably means something's really, really bad. bad. Right, yeah, right? totally. Um, what about the other, did you, did you reach customer service with anyone else? No, I mean, we got <clears throat> sort of through to Bank of America with pressing zero. I never got a human okay. being, but it just it, it just kept routing me straight to the, mm -hmm. it put me on hold to talk to a human being. Uh -huh. But then we were on hold for like 15 minutes. I was like, okay. Bank of America is another this. one. I actually, uh, that was my bank for a long time and I used to get furious on the phone. Yeah. Um, and I actually looked up the worst customer service in America and Bank of America was right in that top really? five. Yeah. yeah. You yeah. know what the hilarious thing about yeah. it is? We get calls from Time Warner Cable at least once or twice a month <laughs> with them trying to sell us stuff. Yeah. But when I actually, I'm like, hey, maybe I'd be interested in buying your cable, nothing. My, <laughs> my conclusion from the customer service hack is, Every single customer service is a little different, so feel free to try them all. Type the yeah. zeros, type new customers. It, it, it doesn't sound like many of them work. It, it, does, it sounds like if they don't want you to talk to a human being, you're not gonna talk to a human being, yeah. unless it's a power company, and right. you're cursing your ass off. But it, it's just, it's an industry of, dis, of deflecting people. It's all they do is deflect yeah. you from yeah. one person to the next. I feel bad for actually the first line of defense of customer service, because they're only armed with like, 15 questions, and then they'll be like, oh, can I put you on hold? And you know they're in their like, computer going, mm. yeah. like I need to find this part of the manual where it says this part. And so you just want to just feel like, yes, I was wrong. Thank yes. you for understanding. I am no longer angry with you and will continue to use your service. To all the My Fortune customer. 500 companies watching right now, if you want good customer service, all we ask, be treated like a human being. Yeah. That's it, it doesn't even have to be great service. Just treat us like you would want to be treated.